Okay, friends, today for math, we are gonna work on patterning. Now, I got out a few different things to use for this activity, but the most important item you're gonna need today are the little animal erasers that I sent you in your packets. Now, everybody's is different, but everybody should have two different kinds of animals, and we're gonna use those for patterning. We wanna work on making an ABAB pattern. Now, I'm gonna use elephants and tigers. Elephants are gonna be my A's, and tigers are gonna be my B's, and I'm gonna work on making an A-B pattern. Now, to help you visualize, to help you see your pattern better, you can use a few different things to help you. So I have out an ice cube tray that's made out of Legos. So I can use this to help me see where each animal goes. Or maybe you have a cupcake tin that you want to use. You can use a cupcake tin to see where each animal goes. Or you can use your whiteboard that I got you and your Sparrow snail mail and you can have mom or dad help you to draw a 10 frame on your board and it doesn't have to be pretty or perfect so i'm going to draw a 10 frame real quick okay so now on my 10 frame i know that i'm going to use these to put my animals inside and i'm going to make an a b a b a, B pattern all the way across on my board. Now, for my older sparrows, maybe you can work on doing an A, A, B pattern and go A, A, B, A, A, B, all the way across. Or maybe you know work on A, B, B patterns. So remember, you have to give each animal a name. Is it going to be an A? Or is it going to be a B and separate put all your A's in a pile put all your B's in a pile and now we're gonna make a pattern I also got out some of my alligator tweezers if you have tweezers at home ask your mommy she might have a pair in her bathroom they'll look a little bit different but they'll still work or if you have some of the teeny tiny um, tongs like we have in our kitchen that we use to scoop out our cheese during lunchtime, you can use some of those if you want to. You don't have to, but you can use the tweezers to help pick up the animals and put them across either in your 10 frame or in your ice cube tray or in your muffin tin and work very carefully to create your a b patterns or your aab patterns or your abb patterns enjoy guys